Hey guys, stay tuned. If you want to know everything about Black Point Marina, stick around. You're definitely going to want to watch this video. Now we are at the actual docks and the, and, and the ramps. So you can see there's five different launch ramps that you can use when you come in and out of Black Point. Okay, so keep that in mind. When it's very, very busy, the very first ramp is closed off so only the boats can come out. But you'll have four other ramps, five normally. Uh, if you're handicapped, there's a section along the front of the actual marina that you can go ahead and park. It's not too far, maybe 10, 20 uh, feet away from the actual launch ramps. If you have a single axle trailer, you can also find a couple of spots that are available in the front. You have to have a single axle. If not, there's plenty of parking in the back. I always suggest in any marina or any air area in South Florida, always make sure that you, you don't leave any valuables exposed, okay? And lock your trailers. That's just a sad reality. As I was saying earlier, here are the ramps. But I also misspoke and I said it was five ramps. It's actually six in total. So we got a sailboat coming in right now and we'll watch him launch. Let me show you the, all the amenities and areas where you can go ahead and hang out here. Oh, I got a jet. Oh, I see. Oh, okay, I see what you're saying. Oh, oh nice. Well, go get those bonefish. <laughs> That's awesome. Here's a better angle and a shot of the actual ramps themselves. So you know exactly how, how steep they are. They're not too, too steep. This is probably as steep as it's going to uh, get. This is uh, right now at low tide. And uh, sometimes you'll see it rise maybe about another two feet from where it's at right now. All right, we're here at a little outhouse, which... Uh, you have a male and a female restroom. So if, uh, if you needed to go ahead and go to the restroom before you get out on the water, here's a great place to come. So if you end up catching a lot of fish that day, the, the day you go out, you got two fillet tables that you can go ahead and clean out your fish. You're gonna have plenty of pelicans that are gonna want all your scraps. And you have your fillet tables here. They used to be nice wood tables, but they change them up. It doesn't give the same feel, but it is what it is, people. So if you need to fuel up, this is a great place to fuel up. You got Suntex Marina, which is right here on the side of Black Point, where you can go ahead and launch your boat if your boat is rented here. The dock is a floating dock and it's pretty uh, pretty big. You have options for fuel. You have diesel and Rec 90. All right, here's a quick, quick tip. If you wanted to go to one of the sandbars, there's three major sandbars. There's Sands Key, Nixon, and Hallover, okay? This marina is closest to Sands Key, which we also as locals call Elliott Key. It's a sandbar, it gets really popular, especially on the weekends. The Columbus Day Regatta is launched out of here, so you guys will see definitely a lot of videos. I have a video of all the three sandbars that I'll put at the end of the video or I'm making a suggestion so you guys can look at that and see some are a little crazier than other, some are more family friendly, but they're all here. So let's go and check out the rest of this marina. All right, guys, listen up. Another pro tip. So you just finished boating. You're about to get out of here. You load your, your boat to your trailer and you're about to leave. But instead of being on the ramp and doing everything on the ramp, you go around the little bend over here and then there's this basically area that people park on the side so you can go ahead and set up everything. It's kind of like a loading uh, zone, but in this case, you're, you're going to load up or unload any of the things that you had on your boat maybe to your pickup or whatever you're pulling it with so keep that in mind oh i forgot to mention uh, be careful with scruffy oh. because if he's wandering this guy might get him and he's around trust me he's around and he's big very big
all right guys so if you ever want to come over here and make it a day and you just want to hang out and see the craziness that happens here at the docks essentially people come over here and they park right here they get the little chairs and they watch all the craziness happen here at the world famous black point marina so let's go ahead and take a little ride on the bike i want to show you guys a little bit of uh, the perspective of behind here so we're in the front right of the marina but behind back there there's a trail that goes all the way to the rocks you guys can see where i've been filming some of the boats So, so let's, let's, bro, look how good this thing is. Guys, this is good stuff. I'm telling you, you're definitely gonna wanna come by here and have some lunch or, oh my God, no, you can leave that in here. <laughs> or even a coat. Oh my goodness, we're gonna talk to Jess in a minute, hopefully. But, let's try this dolphin out. Oh my God. I gotta go. Oh, I gotta go. This is great. Alfred, I don't know how they found out you're here, but they said you're not supposed to be here without them. What are you talking about? My God, bro. <laughs> Hello. I'm not, no, I just came over here real quick because they asked me to come over here. Okay, look, fine. I'll go back and I'll get you something. I'll bring you something from over there. No, I mean, I... How'd you guys find out that I was here? Well, well, it's time out time for me, guys. I'm out of here. So, but whatever. We had a good time. It was fun while it lasted, but it's time to go home. So, I don't know. I don't even know how they found out. It's 
it's my daughter. Somebody tipped off my daughter. I know. I saw one of her friends here. Whatever. It is what it is. I'm going to make it better. I'm taking some bow tie pasta home. Hey, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, more amazingness. Because that's what we do on this channel. Boom!